Alan. Hi. Uh, your maid said I should just come on in. Well, Olivia, how delightful. Uh, did you did you get my message? Wow, Claire, great dress. Uh, uh, did you? Oh yes, my secretary said you called, but from out of the country. From San Cristobal. Really. Well, would you like some something to drink, some juice um, or something? Uh, sure. Uh, mineral water, a slice of lemon. Huh. <laughs> Should I just have it monogrammed, a special glass, perhaps? Well, please, sit down. Oh, thank the you. The message said you uh, have a proposal for me, I believe. Actually, I think I said proposition, and yes, I do. And this, huh. I think you're going to find very, very stimulating. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so where were we? Yes, I think you were just about to proposition Alan. Uh, in the business sense, of course. <laughs> and knowing how business conversations bore you, Claire, uh, please don't feel like you have to stay here. Bore me? <laughs> Why, business conversations don't bore me at all. Unless, of course, we're talking about the hospital. I'm afraid I won't be able to concentrate with two such beauties in the same room. And I think that Olivia deserves my undivided attention right now. I'm sure you understand. Yes. Yes, more and more each day, darling. Mm. Uh, bye. to the loo Okay. Ah, uh, where to begin? Well, any way you like. Okay, money. My favorite subject. <laughs> Alan, Lewis Construction is this close to securing a major deal in San Cristobal. Oh. The, the renovation and expansion of the entire harbor area. Now, we have a terrific concept already laid out, and Edmund is already on board. San Cristobal is a very tricky place to do business at this time, and Edmund, I'm not sure how much longer he's going to be on the throne. Well, the deal is actually with the Secretary of Economic Development, and the Tourist Board is also in on it. They're both government agencies that will continue to function no matter who's in power. So you see, I've got my bases all covered. Yes, you certainly do. Which leads to the next question. What does any of this have to do with me? As I said, Edmund is completely on board with the concept of the renovation. He will recommend Lewis for the job. But? Well, we're just, we're finishing the spire for you, and we have some other projects in development, so we don't really have that kind of cash readily on hand. Mm. And this project will obviously need significant startup costs. Mm. And you don't have enough, so you need a loan. Yes. <laughs> well, that's what banks are for. Oh, well, you know, I mean, given the political situation in San Cristobal, it's going to be kind of tough to sell it to a bank. And it wouldn't be tough to sell it to me? Wait a minute, Alan. I mean, you know all the parties involved, especially me. I would never drag Lewis or you into anything that I didn't feel I could pull off. And if you do? When I do. Well, it's clear what the Lewis's will get out of this. Of profits, prestige. But Olivia, tell me, what will I get? What will you get? Mm-hmm. You will get a hefty return on your investment without even lifting a finger. Hmm. So you want my money, but you don't want any involvement from me, right? And your husband, Josh, will be in control, No, huh? we would be in control. But you but... work for Lewis, not for Spall. Look, I have always looked out for your best interests, haven't I? I have. Look how well I have represented you on the Spire project. Do you think you'll be able to cover the Spire and San Crystal? Alan, I can do anything I set my mind to. Oh, I'm sure you can. But you know, I have my own construction division. I mean, why do I have to bankroll uh, Lewis when I could get the deal myself? Well, you just can't, that's all. I've already sold Edmund on a very unique concept, and I'm not going to share it with you until we come to terms. Mm. Besides, I'm a native San Cristobalian. I know how to do business down there. I'm doing business there right now. Not at this high a level. This project will require a lot of support from some very influential people. Mm. I have relationships with them already. Uh -huh. Besides, you're construction division is a bit overextended, wouldn't you say? I mean, you hired us to do the spire for you. So even if you had the wherewithal to pull this off, Alan, you don't have the manpower. There's a hefty amount of risk involved. The higher the risk, the greater the reward, Alan. It's a simple concept. Come on, I've got the ways, you've got the means. 
We can use each other. A very impressive presentation. <laughs> Is that a yes? Well, I don't like to make decisions like this on the spur of the moment. What? what? Since when? Just give me a few days. All right, look, once this project is successful, and it will be, mm -hmm. Lewis will get more work in the Caribbean. Just help us out with this, and I will give you a percentage of all future deals. Mm -hmm. Exactly how much help are you referring to? Well, I haven't really mapped out a detailed budget, but ballpark? Probably just into eight figures. Mm -hmm. Plus future commissions, and you're still my eyes and ears on the spire? Always. Well then I think we have a deal. <laughs> of course, pending my approval on the figures. Oh, don't worry. I think you're going to find them very attractive. Well, coming from you, I have no doubt. Oh, boy. I think I'm going to enjoy doing business with you. I think the pleasure's going to be all mine. <laughs>